Today I rewrote the career of Christian Pulisic, the LeBron James of soccer, or as I like to call him, overrated as fuck. Yes boys, welcome back to the series where we take a player back in time and completely change his career path. And we usually do this by changing the club he starts off at and the position he does play. In this video, instead of Christian Pulisic starting off his career at Borussia Dortmund, he starts it off at Bayern Munich. However, we did not change his position so he will remain a left wing. And as usual, we'll go 9 seasons in the future to try to make him the best player in the world. Boys, here we have a 17 year old 69 rated Christian Pulisic. I'm recording this before the Mexico vs USA game and I feel better for Pulisic already as they already lost. I just know. Oh yes boys, like I said, we will be rewriting Christian Pulisic's career starting him off at Bayern Munich. When Pulisic did start off his career, he started off at a high note, starting for Borussia Dortmund, and he's already 69 rated. First things first, how are we going to guarantee that Pulisic plays every single game? Of course, we're going to have to release every single left wing at Bayern Munich, so he does play every game. The first task at hand is to give him a development plan so he can grow faster than usual, and as per usual, I'm going to go for inverted winger to work on his finishing since he is an attacker. But boys, at the end of the night seasons, we'll add up his goals, his assists, his trophies, and of course, his Ballon de Oros. Throughout the whole video, we're allowed to transfer him at any time, wherever we want him to go. It's time to sim to the end of the first season. Make sure to leave your predictions down below. How will Christian Pulisic do in his new career? Okay boys, we have reached the end of the first season. Let's see how Pulisic did. Being a Bayern Munich, I'm pretty sure he already won his first trophy and his first league title as well. And it's going to be, yes, an easy league win with 83 points. Can they win a treble somehow? DFB Pokal, did they win that? And yes, they have. That's a double so far. As for the Super Cup, if they do end up winning it, Pulisic has his first ever domestic treble. And it's going to be an easy victory for Pulisic. Okay boys, three trophies to his name already. Already. Question is, did they win the Champions League and go for the quadruple? As we go to Group B and... How were they eliminated in that group, man? Okay, boys, they went down to the Europa League. If they didn't win this, I swear, I'm going to be pissed. Looking at the Premier League round, did we win? And yes, we took down Spartak Moscow with E, 6-4, round of 16. Did we win as well? We beat Leicester 4-0. As for the quarterfinals, we did end up winning Real Betis 3-1. In the semis, we do play Atletico, I do believe, and we have lost 4-3. But it's an amazing first season from Pulisic, growing up a plus 7, now at a 76 rated. But boys, it was obvious he was going to shine here with the squad he does have at hand. Okay boys, question is, how many goals and assists did he get this season? I'm backing for at least 10 goals, considering he probably played about 50 games. My man can't greedy, but I'm pretty sure he can play football, and it's time to find out. And he did score 4 goals. 7 growth, but only 4 goals, that is disappointing to see. Obviously, he does grow a lot because he has a lot of potential and his development plan as well, but what a poor showing from a 17-year-old Christian Pulisic. You're trash, kid. Okay, boy, season number 2, he did grow up a plus 1 in the offseason, and he's already representing his national team. He is supposed to be known as the LeBron James of football, and so far, he is not delivering, man. Exciting prospect means he still has a potential of 88+, plus. development plan-wise, we're gonna have to keep inverted winger because we want him to score more goals. But boys, at the moment, I want to keep him at Bayern for another season, so let's see how he does. But let's sim to the end of season two and see how he performs this time. Okay, boys, first below on the door of this video is going to be please don't be killing the Bapier already and Robert Lewandowski. That should have happened in real life, man. Okay, boys, end of season two, it's time to see if Pulisic has won it all with Bayern Munich already. Okay, boys, another league title for Christian Pulisic. There was never in doubt. As for the DFB Pokal, did they win it back-to-back -back as well? And no, they lost to Leverkusen in the final. As for the Super Cup, surely that one was back-to-back. -back. And yes, boys, that's one trophy for him this season. Pulisic has won everything available with this Bayern Munich side except one thing, and that is the Champions League. They did go ahead and go to the knockout stages this time in Group F and yes boys. Okay boys, as for the round of 16, they did end up beating Sevilla 4-2 in aggregate. As for the quarters, they beat Chelsea 2-0. No? Okay boys, they're in the semis. Did they win it all this year? Semifinals and they're in the final against Atletico. Can they win this time? And no boys, they lost 1-0 to Atletico. Okay boys, another amazing growth from Pulisic this season. Another plus 6 scoring from a 77-83. Pulisic has officially reached 83 overall like he is in FIFA at the moment. Still yet to win the Champions League, so I'm going to keep him here at Bayern Munich for another season. But boys, we know he can deliver in growth. But the question is, can he deliver in goals like he did in last season? And... Huge improvement for him as he got 14 goals and 3 assists. Slowly becoming that goal score player that we do want him to become. But boys, a brilliant season number 2. Let's go ahead and go to season number 3. You're trash, kid. Okay, boys, season number 3 and he's already becoming one of the best wingers in the Bundesliga. Only missing the Champions League now. As soon as we win it, I'm probably going to transfer clubs because I want him to go everywhere and achieve everywhere. But boys, another season for Pulisic means another development plan. And I think it's time to switch it as he has now potential to be special. But boys, the so considered LeBron James of soccer let's see what we're gonna give him this time and i think we have 
I think we have to give him wide playmaker. Okay, boys, this is him to the end of season three, and let's hope he can finally win the Champions League so we can go ahead and move to another club. Okay, boys, second ball on the road in this video. I still don't expect Christian Pulisic to win it, but let's just see, and it's it's probably going to be Kylian Mbappe, to be honest, and yeah, of course it is. Okay, boys, end of season four. I'm hoping we won that Champions League. But boys, I'm pretty sure we won the league title, and Bruh. we haven't. Oh, no, boys, this team might start to fall apart. Since we can't make any signings, the players do start going down since they get older. But come on, boys, let's win the DFB Pokal, and we have not won it. Mucho glad back won it super cup that we at least win that one and yes we did okay boys we're in group b considering we didn't win the league i'm hoping we at least passed in second and yes we passed in first as for the round of 16 how did we do and we ended up beating barcelona 4-3 on pens quarterfinals we beat Inter 3-2 that's a good victory and in the semis we lost to madrid 5-2 man and boys christian Pulisic has gone up a plus five now reaching an 88 rated he went from being one of the best wingers in the Bundesliga to one of the best wingers in the world in just a season but boys you know what i said i was gonna leave to win the champions league but this team is kind of in shambles with manu nowhere going down and that is gonna affect us a lot so i'm probably gonna move in the next season but boys so far Pulisic's best ever season is 14 goals did he go ahead and beat that this year and yes he has constantly improving 22 goals and three assists an amazing season for Pulisic and he is slowly becoming that title that he does have which is the LeBron James of football but boys that was season three let's hope for better in season four and see what offers we do get from other clubs your trash kid okay boys season number four he has two ratings off that 90 rating but like I said boys I'm gonna go ahead and start listening to offers because I am worried about the state of this club okay boys sadly we have reached Dylan Day and we got zero offers for Pulisic so that means he will remain here another season so i'm hoping that the goalkeeper situation gets better now that Neuer is a little bit lower rated one of the younger goalkeepers step in and grow a lot but as for the development plan this season let's let's go ahead and give him a inverted winger again his finishing can still improve season number four and he will remain with Bayern Munich let's see how he does hopefully he can win that Champions League okay boys third ball on the of the video Pulisic can now be in the contention but i still don't think he'll win it Kylian Mbappe presents your award and Serge Gnabry, our teammate. Okay, boys, it's the end of season four. Come on, LeBron James of football. Carry this team to the Champions League title. Okay, boys, please tell me they didn't miss out on the league title again. Surely they couldn't. And they have again, boys. We have to leave now. As for the DFB Pokal, surely they have won that. And yeah, they have not. Okay, boys, if Pulisic does not win the Champions League, this could be the first year he doesn't win a single trophy in his career. And Group F, they passed in second place. That's not a good start. Round of 16, they went ahead and beat Man no, Leicester City 4-3. In aggregate quarterfinals, they ended up beating Man City this time 3-2. Semis, they lost to Monaco 4-2, man. This club is in shambles. He has now cemented himself as one of the best players in the world, Christian Pulisic, 91 rated. But boys, this squad is struggling. Pulisic being one of the main stars. Can he get more goals than 22 goals than he did last season? And no, boys, 11 goals and 11 assists. Pretty disappointing season considering goals, but an amazing season considering assists. I would still take it as a good season, though. Did get involved more in the assist-wise to help Robert Lewandowski score a lot of goals. But boys, my point still stands. He must lead the club because this team is slowly falling apart. You're trash, kid. Okay, boys, season number five, 91 rated. This is a good rewrite so far. With five trophies to his name, but the Champions League still yet being an issue for him, it's time for him to go, and hopefully this time we get some offers. I have taken matters into my own hands. FIFA is very bad with transfer offers. So I sent Pulisic to a club that is pretty realistic, Liverpool, who have won a Champions League like once in this video. They have a pretty decent team. I could have easily sent them to Barcelona, Madrid, or Man City, the three strongest teams in the game, but but you know what? I wanted to make it a little bit difficult. Not only that, but I saw Giovanni Reina was on the side. I wanted them to team up once again. Not only that, I wanted to play under club once again. But boys, now that he's joining a new club, that means he needs a brand new development plan. He is now the highest rated in this club. Let's see what we're going to give him. And let's go Let's go ahead and let, let's just give him one playmaker. But boys, let's sim to the end of season 5. And let's see how Pulisic does in his first season in the Prem. Okay boys, another Ballon d'Oro. I'm pretty sure he's going to go and bat by this time. It's been a while since he's wanted to be fair. And... Ooh, yes, he has won it. Okay boys, end of season number 5. Please tell me we have won something. Okay boys, as we scroll up, did we finish in the top 4? And yes, we're guaranteed Champions League football next season. 4th place now. 3rd place. Decent finish. I was hoping for a Prem title, but you know what? We'll take it. FA Cup still hasn't won a trophy in a while. No, my United have won it. Carabao Cup was won by Liverpool. That's his sixth trophy of his career. Okay, boys, in the Champions League this year in Group B, did they go ahead and pass and... <sighs> third place. That means Europa League football. Okay, boys, surely it didn't even make it to the Champions League quarterfinals or round of 16. They have won the Europa League. Preliminary round, they went ahead and lost to Antalisa Sport. 
That's how bad it is. However, that did not stop Pulisic to growing a plus one to a 92 rated. You know what? It may have been a bad position everything wise, just not winning a trophy and not doing too well with the side. But you know what? I'm hoping he had a good individual season. His best ever season remains 22 goals and it's going to be 28 goals and 11 assists, his best season yet. A pretty good season for Pulisic, but not for Liverpool itself. I'm hoping maybe by the next season, he will have a Ballon d'Oro to his name, but there's only one way to find out. You're trash, kid. Okay, boys, season number six, and I have faith for a better season for Liverpool this season. Human plans, development plans. What shall we give him? He's already one of the best players in the world, and the side for the best player at Liverpool. He can't grow this season, but just in case he decides that he can grow, we're going to go ahead and give him wide winger. Okay, boys, I feel like season six is going to be special. Let's go ahead and sim to the end of the season, and let's finally win that Champions League. Okay, boys, I'm hoping for Pulisic's first ever Ballon d'Or, and it's awarded to Kylian Mbappe. Okay, boys, end of season six, please. Finally, after simming six seasons into the future, he has to have that Champo title. Okay, boys, they have finished in the top four. Did they win the league title or finish in the top two? Top two it is. Did they win that league title? And, boys, yes, they have by by a lot of points. But that's like 19 or 18 points. Come on, boys, that's one trophy for him. Can he get an FA Cup as well? And, yes, he has. That's a domestic double for him. Come on, get a domestic treble, Pulisic. And it is a... No, it's a domestic double. Two trophies to his name this season. Let's get a third one and let it be the Champions League. Group H. Finished in first, round of 16, they ended up beating Lyon 5-2, quarters, beat Man United 5-3, semis, lost to Man City, man. Now at a 93 rating, another plus one for him. Diego Jota, on the other hand, is shining, but great season from him. I'm assuming it's a great season. There's only one way to find out, really. Okay, boys, his best ever season today, I still believe it's 28 goals. Let's go ahead and see what he did last season, by the way. 37 goals and 11 assists. That is the best season put out by Pulisic this video. Pulisic now has officially scored 100 goals in his career. Let's him to the next season. We'll give him one more year here. If it doesn't work well for him, we'll go ahead and transfer him to another club. You're trash, kid. Well, season number seven for Pulisic has pretty much won everything available to him except the Ballon d'Oro and the Champions League. Okay, boys, development plan. Can he even receive one? Can he even still grow at this point? He still grew up a plus one, even though I said he couldn't. And yeah, no growth for him. It might be only be a one plus this year. Come on, boys. Season number seven has to be the one for Christian Pulisic to win the Champions League. Not only that, but the Ballon d'Oro as well. Okay, boys. Season number seven. It's time for Pulisic to win his first Ballon d'Oro. And Diego Jota has won. It's still missing out. It's the end of season seven. Please, Pulisic, deliver that Champo trophy. Okay, boys. Top four once again. I'm hoping. And yes, boys. Come on. Another league title back to back. And yes, another league title. Community Shield, can we win that as well? No. FA Cup, it's time for it to be ours. Yes, boys. That's two trophies out of three. Can we make it three out of four? No, boys. Okay, boys. Group G, then we pass on to the round of 16. And yes, boys. In first place with five wins and one draw. Round of 16, we beat Bayern Munich 4-3. Quarterfinals, we beat Atletico 5-4 on pens. As for the semis, boys. We lost to Atalanta of all teams. We just can't win a Champions League trophy. A plus one for Pulisic this season, now at a 94 rating. That is absolutely amazing. Okay, boys, can he somehow beat the 37 goal season he had last year? I sincerely doubt it. And 24 goals and 15 assists is still a brilliant season. Boys, I know I said this would be the last season in Liverpool, but to be honest, this is the best opportunity we got. I know if I transfer this to him, we're going to get offers from like Brighton like we did earlier. But we're going to keep him here and hopefully win the Champions League title in the next two seasons. You're trash, kid. Okay, boys, season number eight. And it's getting pretty tiring to see Pulisic be an amazing player for so many years. And he just can't win that UCL title. This team is absolutely amazing. I just I just can't understand why they can't deliver on the biggest stage. But my plan, once again, he, he can't even grow. So it doesn't even matter. Come on, boys. We're speedrunning the last two seasons of this video. Come on, Pulisic. You have to win it at least once. Okay, boys, eight seasons in. Surely this is the year that Pulisic takes it home and is given to Diego Jota again, man. Okay, boys, come on. The second to last season in this video, hoping that he finally has won it. Okay, boys, come on. Give us another Prem title and let's go, boys. Another Prem League title by nine points. Okay, boys, Community Seal, did we win that as well? That's two for two trophies. Can we make it three for three with the FA Cup and Burnley in the final, bro? How is this happening? But Palace win it. Carabao Cup, come on, make it three trophies. No. Okay, boys, eight years in the Champions League and still yet to win it for Pulisic. Has been very unlucky. Group H in first place with 15 points, round of 16. Okay, 5 2, quarterfinals. Beat Chelsea 4 2, semis. Boys, we're in the final for the first time in this video, and let's go, boys. We have done it. We have been in Barcelona in the final. Pulisic has finally won that Champions League that we've been waiting for. Not only that, but has won a triple while doing it. Another two trophies for Pulisic. However, he remained at a 94. Come on, boys. Pulisic's best ever season is still 37 goals. Did he go ahead and achieve a little bit better? And 30 goals and 16 assists. He's absolutely killing it with the assists as well. Okay, boys. One season left to go. And at this point, he only needs one thing. 
and the one thing he does deserve, and it's the Ballon d'Or. You're trash, kid. Okay, boys, last season for Pulisic. I'm not even going to give him the development plan. Let's just go straight away and sim to the end of the season. I'm hoping for the Ballon d'Or to win. At this point, I don't care about anything else but that Ballon d'Or to win. Okay, boys, last try for Pulisic to win the Ballon d'Or. Will he go this whole video without winning one end? Let's go, boys. He has done it. The perfect end to this video. Well, we still need to go to the end of the season. 95 right now has finally won that Ballon d'Or. Okay, boys, with everything won for Pulisic, possibly... I'm very happy with the result of this video. Final season and a final Premier League title won by gold difference. That's insane. Community Shield, can we win that as well? Two trophies out of two. Can we make it three out of three, boys? FA Cup, we lost to Chelsea in the final. Carabao Cup, can we still make it a trouble? No, Aston Villa. UEFA Super Cup, though, gives us our third trophy of the season for the first time in this video. Champions League was not won by us. But, boys, Pulisic does finish off this video at a 95 rating. Okay, boys. Still, his best every season was 37 goals. Did he somehow get 40 and... 33 goals and 17 assists. Another great season, man. Okay, boys, these are Christian Pulisic's final stats. Started off his career at Bayern Munich and ended up at Liverpool, starting off at a 69 rating, finished at a 95. Scored 203 goals, 93 assists, probably the highest assist count we have ever had. 16 trophies, I think another record-breaking stat, and one Ballon d'Oro. It took him eight seasons, but he finally won that elusive Champions League. But that is the end of this video. I consider this video a success. It looks like Christian Pulisic maybe is the LeBron James of soccer. Make sure to check out my last video. I simply until Ibro won the Champions League.